Hello, this is Castle Smashers. I will be diving into the Super Nintendo today <clears throat> with, as we can see, R-Type 3, the third lightning. Blast off and strike the evil Baido Empire. <clears throat> so, I think with these older kind of games, I might actually read out the story from the instruction manuals just to give some sort of perspective, whatnot. Um, here we go. The Baido Empire returns. The powers of the Baido Empire have returned. Uh, now stronger than ever. These diabolical extraterrestrials are poised to attack the Earth. Mankind has just one hope against these mutant beasts. The formidable R9 is headed for the front lines at the very frontiers of space. Armed with high-powered advanced technology defences, is the ultimate battle machine, but is it enough? So I guess R-Type is the type of machine which is called R. So yeah, as you can see, just here it's like a, a side-scrolling vertical shooter. Uh, I'll just check the options first, as I always do. Check the controls. Shot. Y shot. Auto shot. Beam mode. I'm sure I'll figure it out. I've got a whole hour to figure this out, so... Oh, just under an hour normally. Alright, let's get into R-Type 3. <clears throat> Alright, so I can select my weapon, it looks like. I've got rollout... <clears throat> Power gain. Okay, so the bottom one is the most powerful. Uh, air to air laser, reflective laser, air to ground laser, reverse laser. Okay, that might be helpful. All range laser and guide laser, whatever. Through laser, which I guess would go straight through enemies, which might be nice as well. Splash laser and a capture laser. Don't know what half of these things mean. I have played this game, but like ages ago when I was like really young. I might select the middle one because it's got a reverse laser. <clears throat> I think that sounds the most. the most effective. <clears throat> Alright, now hopefully I don't get too many deaths because I know these games can be quite hard. Alright, so that's me shooting. Power up. Cool. Oh, okay, and I've got hyper beams as well. Might give one of those a go. Let's switch to hyper. Oh, and don't get hit by any of these things. Oh, okay, so that's a hyper. Alright, I think I want this thing on the front for now. So yeah, I think the, the interesting thing with this game... There's my reverse laser. Oh, and I've got a little guide laser as well. <clears throat> so I think the interesting thing about these games is that... Um, I have my little... My weapon on the front that I selected just before in the menu. And... Um, yeah, you can disengage it. Uh, it acts like a shield. <clears throat> yeah, I sort of remember this start bit. <clears throat> a little bit, not too much. <laughs> but as I was saying, you get your little weapon on the front, you can upgrade it. Um, hyper powered lasers. And I guess you don't need too much story for, <clears throat> for these type of shooting games either. Oh, I've got two guided, guided lasers now. It's just hard to control them, that's all. I'm not, I'm not reverse lasering anymore. That's alright. I'm sure I'll hit them some at some point. Just need to make sure I don't get hit. Uh, uh. 
It's a bit of um, it's a bit of maneuvering to make sure you don't die. <laughs> and I guess this isn't as as bullet hell as typical bullet hell kind of kind of games. Oh, I'm not getting hit by you today. I'm surprised how well I'm going at the moment. I, normally I die pretty early in these games, but <clears throat> I was going to say, I'll say that right now, and that means I'll, I'll probably die pretty soon. <clears throat> but uh, I have played a few different R-type games. Like, I think there's some on Game Boy. Um, I think a wall just comes at me here very soon. Or I could be wrong. No, there we go. The wall just crashes into me. <clears throat> so as you can see, the big, the big beam that I, that I unleash can actually go through the walls. And the music as well, it's like a, a, a like electro rock. Very catchy. I can actually see this working for Mega Man. Do I have to shoot that? Oh yes I do, okay. <laughs> I'm like, is that gonna let me through? So I'm changing up a bit here, I'm actually using a... the analog stick to, to play this game. I think I get more precision out of the analog stick than with the D-pad. <laughs> But if it can help me, then why not? Whoa, okay, this, this item's pretty good. It goes along the walls. I think that helps for those um, those ones that are camping out there as well. The ones that I couldn't necessarily get. Oh, this is the hard bit. I might need the D-pad here for a bit more precision. Just to stay in the middle. <clears throat> Hopefully I don't get hit by something. Alright, let's just stop. Oh! Yeah, that helps a lot with those ones up along the walls. Okay, I think they, I think it cycles through all three of them. And I think this one is probably the best for now. Because there's guys coming behind me. And there is like, the X button it said was an auto-fire button, but... I don't know, I'm doing it the the dumb way, I just keep mashing the Y button to shoot. Probably make my finger more tired, but... Sorry, my thumb. My thumb more tired, but... That's alright. Alright. Okay, I probably shouldn't have got that. I think it would have been better me sticking with the, uh, the weapon where I shoot behind. Oh, there we go. Oh. Okay, that goes in front and above. Oh, and from memory, I think this little attachment that I just got, this little ball with the thing circulating, that white thing circulating, is like a um, if enemies come in close proximity, it'll hit them. Whoa, whoa. Okay, <laughs> should focus on. Uh, I've got a boss here, so I think he's gradually coming towards me. Maybe, or at least, at least these beams are coming towards me. Now he's coming towards me. He's getting closer. Can I hit him? Just a little bit. Those mode... Mode 7 graphics. Right there. So whether this is going to be his general attack... Okay, now he's... Now he's within range. Alright, I need to make sure I... Take care of his... Weapons. So normally the thing with these bosses is if you don't take out if you don't take out their missiles and only focus on damaging the boss then you kind of have a bad time I've found out so I guess if you're only focusing on the box then you'll just get hit by everything he's throwing at you so normally if you normally if you're taking out his his weapons his missiles like I'm doing now some of them are bound to hit him, so... Oh, okay, here we go. It worked, and I haven't died once, so I've still got all my all my lives down the bottom there. 
So that's alright, I'm on to the second level. I think it just transitioned, yeah, it just transitioned straight away to it. Ooh. Okay, there's some sort of acid here. Oh no, this one's worse. Oh, okay, I panicked there. <laughs> I panicked, that, we that weapon was worse. And now I think I start off... Yeah, I start off with just the basic weaponry now. Which kind of sucks. Oh, and these, these little ball things follow you. Alright, get through unscathed. Ugh. Oh. Uh, I know what's going to happen here. I'm going to die right on this first section every single time. And then I'm going to have to start again. Right from the start. Alright, maybe I should try the D-pad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as I try the D-pad, uh, I just kill myself. Alright, there's pretty much all my lives gone on this start bit. Which is not good. Uh, it just sucks that these things follow you. Can I go through here? Oh yes, I can. Good, good. Uh, I just want to get my weapon. Ah, they're all following me! Alright, I can use that that shield to... Alright, this is okay. I don't mind this. It's not completely shooting behind me, but that's okay. Oh yes, get that! Alright, there's... Oh, this... this oh. Okay, just ramped up difficulty really... Really bad there. And game over. Yes, I will continue. I don't know how many continues I actually have, but... Okay, this, this is okay. This is a nice starting point. I'm gonna wait till that gets in view as well, so I can take out a few of those. I know that I can go up here. Alright, I've got it on the front now. I need to try and stay as far back as possible. Even though there are any... <laughs> I was going to say, even though there are enemies coming from behind me, so... <clears throat> I think with like a lot of muscle memory and like learning enemy patterns and things like that, like you can get quite good at these games. I mean, I've only got a certain amount of time to do it in right now, but... Right, I think these things are good to take out with those little balls, the red balls. I think they're really good. <laughs> oh my god, the the red balls just came up from the from the ground to get me. You know, it doesn't matter where you position your ship, you're not safe anywhere. So I need to remember not to stay so close to the ground when I get to that section. Just oh, <laughs> game over again. I think I've got unlimited continues. <clears throat> I hope I've got unlimited continues because it didn't it didn't show any kind of number. So I'm assuming that because I know there's checkpoints, you can get to checkpoints. So I think if you lose a life, you go back to the checkpoint. But ugh, if you lose your continue, then you go right back to the the start of the stage. I think. I don't know why, but always when I was a kid, I always thought this, um, the ship looks sort of like a, a bird. I don't know, like the front bit sort of looks like a beak. Ugh. It's that little hole that I just can't get through. What I've got to be really careful of as well is that, um... Uh, what I've got to be really careful of as well is that I don't get really far, but then I've only got one continue left. Oh, I, I've been trying to avoid everything else, and then I come up against that, the dropping acid stuff. Alright, I think I do have unlimited continues. That's, that's nice. I'm not going to loo lose too much progression. <clears throat> oh, no. Oh, okay. Alright, go up and across. I don't think I... Uh, what? Oh, 
Okay, so the little ship that actually gives me weapon upgrades is the thing that killed me this time. Everything is literally out to kill me. If anything hits me at all, I'm dead. The fun of these games. Oh. Alright, I need to be careful not to stay too close behind. Alright, so that comes out. Ugh. Maybe I should plug in like a real Super Nintendo controller at some point. Oh, sorry, not at some point, at, at some day. I should be playing these games with actual, actual controllers, whether it be more precise or not. Who knows, but it's the way it is intended to be played, so... Oh, let's get this. Upgrades. Alright, I'm going okay. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Okay, that was the part where they were coming from the ground. Yes, this is exactly the weapon combo that I want. I don't want to get something different. I don't want the acid falling on me. Gotta watch out for everything here. Every single thing. I'm sort of... I'm protected from... Above and below. Which is okay. Oh, no, I need to let these... I'm not getting that weapon upgrade. I need to let these acid drops drop. I don't know what that M did either. Oh, jeez. Mm. Alright, I'm getting I'm getting pretty far. Now, uh, exactly what I said is going to happen. Oh, no. Alright, I need that. Yeah. Yeah, exactly what I said is going to happen. I've got zero lives left. And I don't really want that. But I have to get it. Oh, no, that's alright. It's a different, a different weapon. Yeah, so I've got zero lives. No continues left, I think. Oh, sorry. I've got plenty of continues. Ugh. Yeah, I've got plenty of continues. I've got unlimited continues, so... Well, oh, no, no, actually, no, I need to... I need to go up. I need to go up, 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 up. Don't die from something. Oh, I'm getting very lucky. Right, stay under this safe place for now. Wait, am I exploding that? How do I get past this? Oh, I think I need to charge up a beam. Oh, game over. I did quite well then. I did very well. I'm very happy with that. And now I'm not happy that I... <laughs> oh, wait, no, that's good. That is... Oh, I am so happy. I started from where I... Where was a good place to start. I don't have ultimate protection, but... That's okay. I'm okay with that. Alright. Okay, so that still attacks behind me, which is okay. Get these suckers behind me. So, I need to charge up... So I need to make sure that I actually charge up a beam so I can go through the wall. Now this is... Oh, I was going to say, okay. That's okay. I know now that when I come back from a continue, I still start from a checkpoint. I thought I would start right back at the start of the... of the level. Level, like, you don't hear that too often anymore. Uh, oh. Like, yeah, all these, all these kind of old games had, like, level 1, level 2, and so forth. You don't see that with many bigger console games nowadays. Like, you don't, you don't beat a level and then it says, oh, entering level 2, or, or whatnot. It doesn't normally do that much anymore. Something so ba simplistic about these, these kind of games. Oh, no. Alright, kill this thing here. Ugh, okay, I killed it, but it killed me at the exact same time, so... That's alright, like, it would've... It would've been... It would've been kind of dreadful to... It would've been kind of dreadful to... To, like, say, come up to the break... The break time point... In this Castle Smashers episode. Having to, like, start all the way back from the start again, rather than... I guess starting from checkpoints, which is always nice. 
I'm probably more reluctant to, to end, an e end an episode if I lose, say, all my continues and then start all the way back from the beginning. Alright. Be very careful. Uh, through there. Don't get hit by those. Alright, that's alright. You only need to charge up. No, charge up completely. Oh, okay, I just made it through there. I need to be very careful with this acid. Very, very careful. I do not want that upgrade because I like I like this weapon combo. I very much like this weapon combo. Oh, okay, my angles. Oh, my angles didn't work good there. That's okay. I can't imagine... A fairly decent checkpoint. F fairly decent. Alright, let's go through here. Oh, that's not really where I wanted that weapon position, but it's okay. Put that on the front now. Oh, okay, I missed that weapon upgrade. Uh, here's the big boss. That's alright, I'll just dodge these sperm... sperm things. Alright, I think I need to hit his eye. That's alright, I'm doing okay. They do like little... look like... I know there are, they are eyeballs, but they look like little sperms. Alright, I need to attack him when his eyes open. Oh, oh. Alright, ugh. Wasn't charged up completely. Oh. There's more and more that just keep coming. As long as I can keep this rhythm up, that's alright. That's alright. So, I'm trying to keep an eye on my ship that I don't get hit, but I'm also trying to keep an eye on... Get it? Keep an eye <laughs> on his eye <laughs> to make sure I hit it. Oh, okay. That was alright. I know I'm right near the boss, so that's all that matters. And I know to get that last. Oh. Grab that, yeah. Yeah, I know to grab that last. No, oh, got a bit lucky there. I need to grab this last one here. Yeah, weapon upgrade. Whether that's going to help or not. Because I need to be charging my laser anyway, so... Alright, I think I'm just going to... shoot where my laser is complete. Whether his eyes open or not. Because all I really need to do is go up and down, to be honest. If I'm if I start going left and right, that's where things start to get get trouble. Oop, no. Nah. Damn it. Are you ready? Uh, that's right. It's okay. I'm in good form still. Alright. Let's go through here. Grab that. I will grab you as well. I don't think there's any kind of like enemy pattern memorization here, really, but <laughs> I just need to be on my game. I, re I reckon I can do this at least before the episode's done. And I think these games only have like. Oh, oh, oh. I need to not stay so close to one area. I need to go down. Okay, yeah. Whew. So, complete concentration. I think the only way I can attack this guy is by hitting with a, a hyper beam or a super beam or whatever. Oh, there's a few more yellow spots now. Oh. No, didn't get him. 
Oh. Oh, okay. I see his, his eye got more red. He had a red eye. Alright, last life. So I think after this life is done, I will go to a short break. Alright, so I'll just repeat what I've done before. Go down here. Get a few power-ups. That should be on the front to protect me. Alright. Lucky last. Lucky last shot before the break. I see. Like, even this music is quite good too. Do -do 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 -do. Ah, keep shoot keep shooting sometimes without my laser beam fully powered up. But then again, I don't really want to look at the bottom of the screen to see if my laser. Ah. All right, game over. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to a short break and then okay, I think I might actually keep continue first and then I'll pause. Alright, okay, so I'm going to go to a short break and I'll be right back after it. See you then. Alright, I'm back after the short break and yep, we have R-Type 3 for the Super Nintendo and I'm just paused here, so let's continue. Oh, I was gonna say, oh, I was wondering where the music was, but I don't think this, it is here, just not, it's not a very prolific theme, the music here. Oh, I missed a, I missed an upgrade, that's alright. I don't think I necessarily need upgrades for this boss fight, I just need to keep my beam charged. Oh, yeah, get him again. I wish there could be someone on the other end of this to tell me when the, the guy opens his eye so I can shoot. I think I just need to shoot wildly a little bit. Because his eye is still white. In the white... Oh, okay, that was, <laughs> that cut it a bit close there. But I reckon I can do this before the episode's out. If I don't, then that is a failure for me. If I, sp if I spend about 25 minutes just trying to beat this boss, then that is a failure. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. I'm not, I'm not supposed to get, I'm not supposed to get killed by things that help me. That is not the way things work around here. It's not the way things work at all. Alright, I'm just going to stay on the bottom. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Alright, that's not fun. I'm only two minutes... Two minutes or three minutes in after the break and I've already got a, already got a complete game over. Lucky I'm not going for a high score, because the high score completely resets when you get a game over. Alright, so I need to stay a bit hot. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say I need to stay a bit high so the so my weapon doesn't attach onto the back. I think I was doing fine just the way I was doing before without coming up with any kind of strategies. I think it, actually I, don't know, I think the weapon follows me. All right, so if I attack down here, that's fine. Yeah, I don't know what that first upgrade did, but. Alright, shoot the eye now. Hopefully I can just keep getting to this boss without dying in the parts before. I wonder if even like the his shooting pattern his shooting pattern of these eyes are the same every single time. I mean there's so many coming at me that it's hard to tell, but yeah. Okay, his, his eye is a little bit red. 
Just a little bit. Do a bit better. Oh, okay. I was doing a bit better. Come on, R type. Use your R powers. The power of R. R, 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 R. Ooh, I'm surprised I didn't get killed there. Very surprised. Alright, Mr. Boss. You are going to get hit right now. Okay, <laughs> well, I knew that was going to end bad there. I could see myself um, going into a narrow gap, so. And literally just like looking at where you respawn after a death there. It sort of looks like um, if you keep going forward, like you'll die anyway. Because it's like, I'll show you if I die next time, but um, it looks like you head straight towards a wall if you don't move out of the way. Okay, lucky for me that beam is actually quite, uh, quite big. Like, it covers a, a fair range. Ooh, ooh, okay, I nearly, I nearly died there. I don't know if staying in the middle is the best option. I think, I feel like I need to stay sort of at the top and then head my way down and then maybe start at the bottom and then head my way up. Oh, actually no, you don't die. I'm moving forward, like, but you are right on the edge of dying. One little move up or down and you're dead. That's alright, I'll get this done. <clears throat> I don't even know if I need this thing right on the front. Anyway. Sorry, my weapon. Ugh, just want to get a shot in, there we go. Ah. <sighs> Rage inducing. Lucky I'm not doing a full smash of this, because <laughs> then that would be, you know what? Actually, like I find the I find these games quite fun, so I don't think that would be too bad. Like at the moment, I'm still playing, or tr still gradually playing Dino Crisis, and that game is just like I sort of just want to get over it. Yeah, I wonder if keeping that that there is going to help me at all. I don't think so. Probably gonna do me a lot worse. Yeah, uh, I, don't, I, I don't know if having the um, having the weapon attached to my ship or not is is really any better or better or worse. But it's probably better having it on there than not. So. <laughs> It's better having it on the front in that case. I do know what I'm going to do for my next full smash. It's going to be a shortish kind of game, so I might be able to beat it in two or three episodes maybe. Depending on how good I am at games. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's... That's for when the time comes. I still need to beat Dino Crisis first. But right now I need to focus on beating this stupid boss because he's... He's really getting the better... He's been getting the better of me. Ugh. Especially that time. Right, I've just got under 20 minutes. Under 20 minutes to beat this. I am having fun, and I hope whoever's watching is having fun as well. 
We need to make life a bit more fun, don't we? During these times, I guess. Oh, okay, that was a nice pickup. Oh, I completely missed him. He was in his invincible frames just then. I shot too early. That was... <laughs> that, yeah, it was not good. He was just closing his eye every time I wanted to shoot him. There we go. Alright, if we're staying a bit higher, it might, might be quite good in some instances, or, or, or quite low. Because he's not shooting... It doesn't look like he's shooting... T oh, no, he's shooting double. Up or down. I think the only way to beat this is to just keep my wits about me. If that's actually an actual phrase. Ugh. And the good thing is that those eyeballs aren't go... Like, they're not coming towards me at different speeds. They're all coming towards me at the same speed, so... If it, yeah, if I can keep my... As I said before, if I can keep my wits about me, <laughs> then, um... I should... Like, it's doable. It's definitely doable. It's not... It's a boss that you can beat... Beat by being persistent. There we go, I got him that time. Yeah, by being persistent and on... Oh, okay, I was gonna say, on... On game, I guess. On your game. Yeah, I think I've got down pat what to do here. Until I die. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm doing okay. Yeah, I know my system on how to get through that first part. You know what? I'm going... I'm not going to talk. I'm going to do this part without talking and see how I go. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> I was just about to say, the moral... If I did that, I was going to say, the moral of the story here is that... Like, sometimes the best course of action is just to keep your mouth shut. <laughs> not say anything. Just in life. Life in general, just... Shut up and roll with the punches sometimes. But, uh, yeah. I think I was going... I think I did some, some good runs there, even when I was talking, so... That's alright. I still have a bit of time. And I don't, I don't think moving forward and backwards is really gonna... going to be beneficial to me. Hmm. Like, I'm even getting to a point where I'm not worrying too much about where he's positioned to get a shot in. I'm just more worried about, like, trying to survive, so... Maybe I should worry even more about that. Just try and survive. Hold down the shoot button to charge up my laser. And then, um... Oh, I didn't get anything from that. That's alright. Yeah, just, um... Charge up my laser and just focus on just surviving and not really worry about where he is. And just let off a shot every now and again. Not really mattering about where the eye is to begin with. Which is sort of what I'm doing right now. I'm just looking at where these eyeballs are coming from. Not really what the boss is doing. No. Oh, okay. So there was a lot of those balls just coming down. Oh, I knew what I needed to do there. I just didn't think quick enough. Oh. Yeah, like I saw that coming before it even happened. I just didn't action on it. I like how I could kill that guy with just like, just the barrier. <laughs> oh, sorry. The, I, don't, I don't know what you call this thing. Is it a weapon? Is it a... 
It's, is it a shield? Is it a weapon? Don't really know what it is. But I think every R-Type game actually has that mechanic. I don't think I've seen one which doesn't have it. Uh, uh, that's probably just like the core... The core of what makes R-Type appealing this... This shield... Oop. What do you call it? This shield... Uh... Weapon. Uh, I'm not really getting any hits in. There we go. I had to look at the uh, the enemy for that one. Ugh. So the I mean the yellow balls move slower than the eyeballs, but I don't think that information is really going to help me too much. I'm having a good time. That's all that matters. Oh, <laughs> oh, that was bad. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> Two deaths in a row without even getting to the uh, the boss. I'm losing my cool here. I'm losing my gaming cool. <laughs> Even then, <laughs> that was just terrible. <laughs> I feel like it's one of those moments where I feel like you just want to step away from the controller or step away from the game for a little bit and come back in a, in a few hours. But at the same time, I feel if I did that, then you, you lose... Oh, oh, I got very lucky there. Yeah, I think if in this in this kind of game, like if you walk away and chill for an hour or so, then you just forget the the um, the pattern of what you need to do. Oh, okay, I was focusing too much on the eye then. Maybe I should move around. That that might help me a bit. Ugh, didn't help me there. I can't believe the entire second half of the episode has just been, just been this section. That's alright. It's okay. No worries. Be happy. Hakuna Matata is what they say. It ain't no passing craze. Hakuna Matata. Maybe that's what I need to play, the Lion King. I've played Aladdin, so... Actually, I'm trying to think how many Disney games I've actually played. Yeah, just Aladdin. Ugh. I did want to do a full smash of the Game Boy Mickey Mouse at one point. Whether I actually do that or not, I don't know. So I did play a few levels of that and it was, it was fun. I thought, oh, this, this is gettable. And like, the save system is passwords. The old school password back in the day. I mean, Super Nintendo games had a lot of passwords as well, so... It's just, just a different time and a different place. For some reason they couldn't get battery... Battery saves. Although, the original Legend of Zelda did, so... There you go. Oh, got him. I feel like I was doing better a while ago. Whoa. Uh, yeah, I feel I feel like maybe the past 10, 10, 15 minutes I've only hit him a few times. Whereas like maybe when I versed him the first few times I was getting getting more hits on him. Need to persist. I will do this. All right, here we go. This time I am going to do it, and I'm not just saying that. I am really going to do it. Oh. 
Just need to keep focused. Very focused. And I need to make sure my laser's actually charged up fully, so... Like that. It's hard to tell what section of those eyes, like the tails, I can go through or not. I did it. I did a little bit better. That's all right. I've got about I've got about five minutes, give or take. Let's just do this. You know what? Even if I don't beat it, it's all right. It's all right. I can't, I can't even remember what's past this boss, like, I think I ha- you know what, I think previous times I've ever played this game, I have managed to get to this boss. It's just, um, I don't think I've ever been able to beat it from memory. Ugh. Damn laser. Ugh. Like, I don't- you can't even kill the- these- these eyeballs that are coming towards you. You're really only just playing the dodging game every time. The whole thing is literally just dodging and hoping you get lucky to hit him. Oh, oh, oh yes, yes. Hell yes. I did it. With four minutes to spare. Let's see what the next level is, which I don't think I've ever seen. Have I seen this? I don't know. Oh yes, I'm in need of a weapon upgrade. I, I, it's not a very good one though, but... Oh, 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 oh. Am I slowly becoming the R-Type King? Am I becoming the King of R-Type? Oh, it feels so good to be back in a regular level. I'm not versing a boss. Yeah, I'll get you. Oh, no. I, yeah, I'm very happy about how this episode's going to end. Oh. Like, I feel good because it's... Yeah, it's just one of those ones where you just die, you die, you die. Like, it's not like you get through a lot of things and then you... Dip, like, sorry, through a lot of um, section and then you die and whatnot. It's... Ugh. It's more like you just keep constantly dying, but... Every time you die, you learn... You learn some more from every death, I guess. At least I th I'd like to think that way. Alright, I'm going to attach this on the, on the behind. Oh, okay, no, it doesn't. Oh, okay, I didn't notice that. It's up like a barrier. Oh, I need... Oh, I was going to say, I couldn't get that, that weapon upgrade. Uh... Alright, um, so I've got about three minutes left. I think I might just call it here. Do you want to continue? No. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to call that an episode. I had a lot of fun with that one actually. It was quite good. It was very good. So that was R-Type 3, the third lightning for the Super Nintendo. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next episode of Castle Smashers. See you then. Bye.